Jean Persani with Beauty and the Stamper. And it's time to do crafting today before the football game. So I wanted to get ready and get started. So let me go ahead and show you what we're gonna make today. So first things first is what did I buy for the project? So uh, you wanna get one of these cylinders. Of course, everything was from the Dollar Tree. So I've got the cylinder. I have one of these candy dishes. I have some adhesive diamond wrap. And then I have this beautiful ornament. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. I also have my scissors and my glue gun, of course. And so let's go ahead and Take the diamond wrap out. So if you are new to my channel, I just wanna say welcome. I know I've been getting a lot of beauties uh, saying that they're recently new and I just think that's super cool. So we're gonna take the little diamond wrap and it is like a sticker. So we can just stick it where we want it. And this one, I want to wrap it around. It's a little too short, so we're gonna have to um, do some cutting. And first things first, I don't know exactly how many diamonds I want. So I'm gonna go with two, four, six. We're gonna, go, we're gonna do six. So I'm just gonna, well, actually, I think I can use this guy. I really love it. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let me show you. Oh, I lost count. Two, four, six. <laughs> I keep losing count. But can you see that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So I just cut right up center my eyes are kind of crossing though I probably should have used like a straight board just to keep it intact and then I know I'm gonna need to cut another one but look at how nice and straight that came out so we're gonna do it again two four and six And then I'm gonna need a third one because it doesn't go all the way around and I wanna put some at the top as well. So we've got two, four, and, wait, here we go, two, three, four, six. Okay, there we go. If you don't have one of these rotary cutters and trimming mats, you you don't know, because I didn't know what I was missing until uh, I started using it. And now I'm like, oh my gosh. So we've got this all nice and clean. And you're just gonna take the sticker paper off. And again, you may want to um, put some hot glue. And I'm just going to start this. Ooh right at the bottom all the way I'm almost pushing it right up against the um, the mat itself and then holding it down at the bottom just straight just turning it so there's that look at how cute that is and then now I need to measure how many I need here so we've got one, two, three, four. Four will do it. And then this, the top will be the same, so I'm gonna cut the four again. One, two, three, four. And then I save this for a future project. 
So we just take the four, again the sticker, and you see, look at how well this holds on. I mean, it is, it's good. I really like the um, adhesive wrap on this. So, my little teeny tiny nails are not working as well as I'd like them to be. I need my little pick tool, but it's all the way in my craft room. So, we're gonna just go for it. We're gonna line those up. And if I lined everything up correctly, it should all go. And you cannot tell at all where that goes. So we've got that. And now we're gonna do the top. And this side works so easy that I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the top. Or I'm just gonna flip it over and do the exact same thing rather than just trying to line it all up. So that might be easier for you. I'm finding it easier for me. So you just kind of hold it along the bottom. And twist this onto it. And it seems to be working rather well. And you can make a whole bunch of these so quick and so easy. I mean, this is just going to take minutes. I love the quick and easy crafts like this. And there you go. Came out perfect. Again, can't tell where it goes. You can't feel it either. So look at how cute that is. Now, we're gonna take this top, and you guys, this top fits perfectly in here. You see that? So you can use this just like that in your bathroom, in your bedroom, if you wanna bling something out. How adorable would that be? But I wanna go just a little bit further and give it a base. So I'm gonna flip this guy right on over, and it looks like a little piece of the sticker stuck there. There we go. I should have checked it out a little bit better than I did. And I think I want the base to go like that. I'm just gonna look to see if there's any more bling that I might want. Cause that is kind of cute. So there's that. And then I wanna stick this guy on there too. But I don't know if I want to stick it at the bottom, if I want to stick it at the top. I'm not real sure on this one. But I do want to kind of, this is way too thick to cut. Yeah, it's not going to cut off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and bend it back just a little bit. and bend it around. There we go. So you can see it's not a real big deal and it doesn't have that little ornament piece. And that ornament piece is just bent around the back. So there you go. Now, I wish I was doing this live so that you guys could tell me because I don't know if I want it down here. that is really cute or if I want it in the middle but I'm thinking down down south is kind of looking good there so I'm gonna go ahead I'm going to put some hot glue right around the bottom here and you can use E6000 I always say this because um, I don't have any E6000 right now otherwise I would do both but if you have little ones that are going to be playing and moving this around, definitely use the E6000 and let it set. 
Perfect. Yep, perfect. Yeah, I would use the E6000 and let it set. And I'm going to see if I want to put some little bling around the bottom. I think I do. But I don't need it to be too deep. Um, but I don't have little ones that are um, going to be getting into this stuff. So I just, the um, hot glue works well for me because I don't move stuff around a lot. I just kind of use a little bit here and there. And then I don't know exactly how much we're going to use out of this one. So I'm just going to cut this again. Because this is always a perfect size, so I don't mind having other pieces of that. We're going to do the same thing. So, I wanted this to be quick and easy, but I think I'm kind of just moving along with what we were doing. So, let's see if this one works as well. Yeah, this one kind of has a little lip, so we're going to just put it around. And then this one. This is much bigger than this one. I didn't realize until just right now when we're doing this. Although these pieces might be shorter now that I'm thinking about it. I don't know. Not. I don't usually math like that. <laughs> so this is the hardest part. I'm sorry. I'm going to try it from this side over here. Much better. And we're just going to go until I don't need any more. And then we'll cut it off. So I'm going to line those two pieces up nicely, and then we're just going to come over here and knead it. There we go. And that one, it's not meeting up completely perfect. Like, there's a little gap, not like this one. But you still, you can't tell really. And then I'm going to take this because I cannot get rid of bling away. And then we're going to take, put our lid on. I don't think we need any bling up here. I mean, you could definitely put bling up there if you wanted to. But I think we're good. we got Stanley barking at nothing over there. I'm just looking, everything looks fine, so there's not really one side better than the other. I'm just going to take some hot glue here. I'm going to glue it right on here, right in the center. Look at how cute this is. I love it. That is super cute for Christmas. And then you can put candy in here. You can put a candle. You could put um, little ornaments or bells would be super cute. So I like it. You could also put some flowers or poinsettias in here as well. So let me know what you think. If you like this, please give me a thumbs up. And also make sure you subscribe if you're not already subscribed because I'm going to be doing more videos. In fact, you guys, look what came in the mail today. For my paper pumpkin people, I'm going to unbox this right away so I can show you. Maybe I can get it out before the football game starts. All right, beauties. Have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. One, two, three, four.